Shh, I'm taking part in a silent barter. I'm gonna trade some of my gold for some salt. So why would I trade this gold for salt? First, we all need salt to survive. If you've ever tasted it in any of your sweat, you know it tastes salty. Second, salt is nature's refrigerator. Salt was used to keep meat from spoiling long before any refrigerators were invented. And third, we still use salt to flavor our food today. We really don't want bland tasting food, do we? So why would I go through a complicated trading process? Well, there are two reasons. The first reason is security. The Ghana Empire controls the Niger River Valley area. Traders pay a tax or fee in order for Ghana's powerful army to watch over and protect the trading caravans and also oversee the business transactions uh, between the salt traders and the gold traders. This means transactions can be done in a rather fair and efficient manner. Plus, this is how Ghana makes their money in order to become or to maintain their empire status as being very rich and powerful. Salt traders from the northern salt fields near the Sahara Desert bring their salt across the river to trade at centers such as this one. So how does the silent barter work? Salt traders come by, leave their salt on the table in the trading area, and then walk away. I come to look to see if the amount of salt that's left is the amount that I'm willing to pay for. If I don't think the amount of uh, salt is worth the amount of gold I'm willing to pay, I just walk away. The salt traders have a decision to make. Do they take their salt, go somewhere else in hopes of a better deal, or do they add more salt to the deal in the hopes of striking a bargain with me and getting my gold? The salt traders need the gold, so therefore they add more salt to the deal. This amount of salt is actually worth more than the gold I'm going to pay. However, the traders need that gold and they don't want to get a bad reputation. So, I take the salt and leave the gold. All right, the salt traders come back and they take their gold and either go home or move on to another trading area and make another deal. This form of trading helps prevent any disputes between me and the salt traders. The second reason is I want the location of my gold mines kept secret so that no one comes and raids them. In a sense, we still use the silent barter system today. We go into a store, we see the goods that we want, and if we think the deal's fair, we take it, and we pay for it by leaving the money at the store and moving on. If we think the deal's not fair, we just go somewhere else or we do without. If you liked this video and found it useful, please hit the like button. And if you want more content, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.